In this video, we're going to talk about running reports and then being able to print out or save to Excel or email the results to somebody. So you can run reports from any module. You can do it from tasks um, and, and basically any reports that have been created from the tasks module um, you can only run them either from the task module or from reports. If it was a task-based report, you couldn't run it from matters. They have their own specific reports, and, as well as the other modules here. So any reports that have already been created will show up in this drop-down down here. And here we've got a number of pre-saved, pre-created reports. So we're going to click on one. We're going to click on Alice 60 day docket. And the filters for this, if you click edit filters, it's where the attorney is Alice and it's due within the next 60 days. So we've got our information here. Now this can be saved in a number of different ways. So if we were to click for example, up here, these buttons, if we click PDF, it'll show this data in a nice PDF document. Uh, you can um, print it, you can save it to your hard drive, uh, whatever you wish to do with it. Optionally, you can click on this Excel icon. And if you click the Excel, it's gonna ask you, do you want to just include the information that's visible? And that's referring to the columns. So right now we're showing just these columns. Clicking on the columns link allows you to include uh, a, a great number of more columns. Uh, we'll just leave it as is now. Uh, but when clicking on Excel, if you click all information, it means it'll return every column or data point available for each of these rows. So it gives you the option to pick one or the other. And now if we click export, it uh, downloads it to our hard drive and you can then open this file in Excel and uh, you basically have it uh, in an Excel format if you wanted to further manipulate the data. And then lastly, you can click on this email icon. And it's going to give you a pop-up. You can pick who you want an email sent to, and it'll basically uh, create that same PDF we saw a moment ago and email it to that recipient. It'll put in the title, subject, all that good stuff. So those are some ways that you can uh, get your data that you've run from a report and you want to uh, kind of save it in some format. Thanks for watching and uh